There are many people who can help you to be safe. If you think you are not safe, you can report this to an adult on your safety network to get help. Some people who can be your safety helpers are your parents, your teachers, your carers, or the police. We call this group of people your safety network. Who are the adults on your safety network that you can report to if you feel unsafe? If you wish, you can pause the video here to work on the My Safety Network worksheet where you can write down the names of your safety helpers. Think of some adults, including family and friends. Your parents and carers can help make suggestions. And then you should let your safety helpers know they are on your list so that they are prepared to listen when you go to them. Who will you put on your list? Not now, go. If you are not getting the help you need, keep trying. It may take a while as adults are often busy. I'm on the phone. Stop, please go away. Don't give up. Mm -hmm. Okay then. It's important if something is wrong or you're not safe to keep trying until you find an adult who stops and listens so you can get the help you need. And now let's all play a game of safety challenge to see if you could remember what we've just been talking about. On Safety Challenge, we ask 100 kids and the top five answers are on the board. Who can be your safety helpers? Come on, what are your answers? Let's have a look at the board and see if you're right. Mum or Dad? SpongeBob SquarePants? No, SpongeBob is not supposed to be on the board. Ah, Teacher? Grandparents, Kids Helpline, and the final answer, Police or Triple Zero. How did you go on Safety Challenge? Wonderful! Now you'll remember who to go to if you feel unsafe. Bye for now. Remember, you are important. You have a right to be safe. If you recognise that you feel unsafe, or if someone is breaking a safety rule, you can react and say no and report to an adult on your safety network.